Yeah, so coming to Goshen, um, I didn't really know what to expect for the most part. It was kind of a new culture, new everything for me. But from day one, uh, not only the basketball team, but the community and the school really welcomed me. And it was something that was pretty cool to me, even on my visit when I came here. It's like everybody was really intrigued to kind of get to know me deeper than basketball. So that was cool to see. And then, I mean, from day one since I've been here, everybody's kind of helped me out and then helped um, all us out kind of on and off the court. Definitely off the court, it's been kind of cool just to be around the community and people kind of recognize us. So that's been kind of cool. And then just for the freshmen now, kind of just being there for them and understanding that's a hard transition from high school, especially on the court. A lot of guys are like the star players on their team and then they come in and might not play right away. But off the court, I know it's been the freshman group we have is a really good group. So it's kind of been fun to hang out with them and kind of get to know them more. A group of guys that have been with each other a couple of years now and we know each other pretty well on and off the court. We hang out with each other a lot. Or we try to hang out with each other a lot and just try to do as much as possible with each other. Because we know that like team chemistry is not only built on the court, but also off the court. So we're trying to like build up on that and just trying to hang out with each other as uh, much as possible. And just trying to watch basketball games with each other, go out to eat with each other, or just hang out with each other, play video games. Or just like be there for each other and relax with each other. That's basically our whole concept of our basketball culture off the court. We try to learn to love each other. Um, you know, we had many meetings before like uh, off the basketball court, like we have compliment sandwiches and like talk about how um, we have two things we like about each other and one thing that we need to work on. And you know, we really take that to heart and really try to, you know, hear what people have to say. And you know, we try to make those changes that we have to work on. So it's really good. Um, yeah, so I think that's something that really has caught my eye since I've got here. Coming in, Coach Young at the time really sold me on the brotherhood of the team. And not that I didn't believe them, but I didn't really know what that meant until I got here. But since I've been here, it's kind of something we've sold our hat on of just kind of being close knit team, kind of being there for each other both on and off the court. And it's kind of been fun to see, so. Um, I mean, to me, it's pretty important, honestly, because, you know, on the court stuff, you know, we always go, go at each other, compete really well. And, you know, we might trash talk every now and then, but, you know, that's, that's okay because in the end, we still like love each other like off the court. We always try to hang out and always try to do stuff together. And I think that relates off the court stuff to on the court stuff with the relationships. So it's pretty vital to have on a team. It, during the preseason this, this past summer, we talked a lot about team chemistry and what that can do for us as a team. So that's why, like I said earlier, we just hang out with each other as much as possible. And like you can see it on the court too. We joke with each other on the court, um, goof around with each other. I know for us, like no matter what happens, I mean, we're, we're, all, we're all boys and we're all 18 to 22, so we fight all the time. But no matter what happens, we all kind of come back. We find a way to kind of welcome each other back to the team. I know guys kind of bicker a lot, but at the end of the day, they all love each other. And you can kind of see it on and off the court, just hanging around us. No matter what happens off the court, guys always find a way to come back and trust each other and just love each other and find a way to kind of be, become best friends and brothers like we normally do. So it's, it's been fun. It's kind, of, it's kind of cool to see groups of kids grow off the court. It's easy to tell on the court because like you get better, but off the court is kind of hard to see. But for us, every kid kind of comes in shy, not really knowing what to expect. But once they leave, you can't really get anybody on the team to shut up. So it's kind of cool to see everybody grow together as a team and as players. So it's been, it's been a fun ride. Um. That's a big one. To me, I think it has to be um, just, I just straight up just say, say love, honestly, because I just feel like um, for certain players, we have to show that and express that because um, they may not get that off the court with, you know, other people or like with their families as much. So I feel like if we show that on a certain like organization and like in this team, I think like that can come a long way for them and they can have that love type feeling when they're done here at Goshen.